Hello and welcome to more Keo Perico speed runs. Before I begin, I'm going to be doing some practice on this Keo Perico island, which I hope that's what it's called. I am going to be practicing diving out of my sparrow onto the tower over here, as well as route to kill the guards to get the gate keys, which I failed massively at last time. I'm in single play right now. I'm using simple trainer, Gogsy's speedometer, which is for us speedrunners, you have to go to the Discord to get it. And I'm also using the flashback mod, which uh, enables me to go backwards in time to make practice a lot easier. That was a mouthful. Okay, so I... I was not very good, obviously. Um, uh, what the hell? That was not very good. Oh! I fixed vehicle very quickly. Very quickly, just fix, fix, fix the vehicle. Okay. Um, okay, well... We turn on vehicle god mode as well. Let's get back in the air. Awful. It takes a while for the engine to engage. Okay. Why does this not want to start now? Okay, bug the vehicle. Fuck it. I'll spawn a new one. Fine. So the trick here is that the wires mini game can spawn like on higher levels. And if you notice that it spawned on a higher level by looking at the guy at the bottom, you just want to dive out the sparrow and parachute your way to that higher level. Where am I? Uh. Okay, well, that was terrible. You can see why I want to practice. The minigame itself obviously doesn't spawn, but uh, his, his spine's not doing well there. I've lost my speed again. I can't control myself. Fucking mods not working perfectly. Rockstar, please fix. Get some popcorn. This is a hard one. Honestly, it seems hard if you're going to try to do it fast. Otherwise, it shouldn't be that difficult. Like, you have to end up flying up pretty high. So just... Uh, controlling the camera is the hard part, I think, man. Oh, what? Huh. Okay, so I guess I want to be out further and higher, but that just takes more time, you know? I just need time to control the camera. I just want to land here. I guess I could practice this forever. Like, as long as I conceptually understand... Uh, why is the vehicle damaged again? As long as I conceptually understand what I'm meant to be doing, it's probably fine. You don't need to go further if you practice enough. It's more that you want to be consistent in it. Like, I guess, if you practice enough, you can understand, like, the limits of how high or low you can be and still get it. And you'll control the camera better, but I'm not going to sit here for a couple of hours doing this over and over and over again. I just kind of want to be within the area that I can get it during a run. One more go at this. I guess I'm gonna land on the top, I suppose. I guess you don't want to land on the top. I guess the textures there are a little bit screwed. But you know what? I should also give myself god mode. That would also be a smart move. Hi. Hello. Did you know I have god mode? Does that impress you? Impress all the women's with your god mode chat. That's perfect. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Trying it and run. It might work. Let's move on. I think you can change your character to online male with the trainer so you can get the exact moveset of that model. Free mode male? It kind of looks like a weird character. I don't know if I have the exact moveset though. I was hoping that the movement limitations would be exactly the same. So I could test which movement makes the most sense in different spots, but I don't think I'm gonna have that luxury. Okay, so we start here normally. And the route I need to take, so we run up here. This is for the gate keys. I shoot a guy here. Yeah, I'm running way faster than I would in the actual thing, but I shoot a guy here. Then I go up here, climb on top of here, shoot a guy that's walking here. So then I continue round here and then up these stairs. Then I shoot the dude that's here, um, wherever he is. Like, he's probably a little bit further up here. They shoot the guy here. Then I go down here. On some level, I should just explore this entire place so I know where I'm going at all times, but... Fuck it. You sneak round uh, a tough dude here, and you shoot two guys here. And then you run back. Although it doesn't show me how to get the key from those two guys if they drop it. It shouldn't be that hard. And so what after that, then I just run down here and use the gate that's down here. Simple enough. Okay, let us finally now start actual runs. As always, 
Time to do all the prep bullshit to get everything prepared for the runs. So I may as well become a motorcycle club dude and call Simeon now before I forget. How can I help? By My just pleasure. existing, man. Now to move a sub. Am I stuck? For real? My graphics are set fine, right? They are. I was unaware I could get stuck with normal shaders. Well, that's going to make this take even longer. Fantastic. Not go too far right this time. Okay, well, I was about to say, what if I went in between that gap and then something spawned in there, which was fantastic. I can't possibly be already stuck. What? I refuse to believe. Okay. I've never had this problem before. I swear this doesn't normally happen to me. Next, the dinghies. How many fails today? Of the highest, zero of everything else, like a lot. It puts away my gun for some reason, this is not my fault. Cargo Bob didn't spawn, no. Thank you, sir. Your Thank you, sir. Ready for you at our nearest airfield. That's great. Okay, why did I destroy it? So it stays. Again, I am putting these here so that it prevents a particular setup from spawning. A destroyed dinghy is not removed, regardless of what you do, unless you change session. I have independent camera modes turned on, so I'm gonna get into this dinghy and change to first person, so that every aquatic vehicle I get into will immediately start in first person. Which is one aquatic vehicle, and that's the long fin later. Boop. Should've teleported away before I got the cops, but fuck it. Why does this bug exist in online where when you make a phone call, it will thaw thawable? Why, why, why set it that way? It doesn't happen in single player. My game just crashed. Do uh, it all again now. Uh, yeah, that gameplay was too intense, man. Pain! It's so weird to think that someone who owns a submarine would need to steal tequila in a foreign country to pay the bills. Have you ever been a person with a submarine? You know, maybe it's a common thing that people do to pay for their submarines. I've never owned one. Liar! Rockstar does claim that GT Online perfectly represents real life. Who am I to doubt them? When a bottle of water costs five grand in this game, no wonder he needs to steal tequila. True. Can you go to the hangar? The hangar is over here. So again, going in and out of the hangar gives you additional movement speed in some interiors. Saves just a tiny bit of time in this run. But you zoom around your submarine when you do this. And now it's a dupe my sparrow. Keep your blood sugar up. Okay, got my snacks. Duped my sparrow. Soon, chat, we begin. Oops, should have uh, brought this up early. Uh, can I still do it? Press thingy just as I'm flying across. Oh, it looks perfect. Oh, look how close that is to the yellow dot. Oh my god. No. Thought I had it there. Okay. What? Uh, it should be fine. Engine's just gonna be a little smoky. It's still good. It's still good. Okay. Random job. Stop the random job. Let us begin. Rip 25 grand. Uh, the worst possible spawn. I think at this stage, I'm going to reset this. This spawn is like a minute time loss or something. It's I'm going to warp here, destroy it, and then warp back. Oh, wasn't in first person. Ah, oh, no. Whatever, whatever. Laser's not super effective. Okay. I'm so bad at this game, I can't even destroy a plane. Are you- are you gave me the same one again? It's, it's like a one in four chance! What are the odds of getting a 1 in 4 chance twice in a row? That's millions to 1! If my math is correct. Can you manipulate the Vellum spawns with exploded vehicles as well? Yes. You can use dinghies to manipulate the other stuff as well. It just takes a fuck long time. So if you want the perfect optimal RNG of spawns, you have to do like another 10 dinghies around the map. I am too bad at the game to bother with such things. So my sparrow has been sitting out in the ocean all alone for a long time. Hope it doesn't abandon me. Oh. Hello. Hello. Good talk, Pavel. Good talk. Okay, we got something that isn't trash. That's a new experience. He's excited. All right, and away we go. Should be angling myself immediately in the correct direction. 
small bit of suboptimal bullshit. Most boring flight in any game ever. True. As a person who's played every video game that has ever existed, I can confirm that this is the most boring part of any video game. The more you know. Okay, just show me my Sparrow game. I do not want to go back and put another Sparrow on that bloody boat. I'm tired of these motherfucking Sparrows on these motherfucking boats. Okay. That looks broken to me. Is that broken? That's broken, chat. I did say it sounded like the engine was going. You guys are mainly here to see me balance the Sparrow on a boat, right? It's like the main appeal of my stream. So, this is fine. Fix it? With what? Am I meant to be fucking MacGyver? You give me like a paper clip, an elastic band, and I'll fix a goddamn helicopter? Do people even get MacGyver references anymore? I haven't even seen MacGyver. Like MacGyver was before my time. I only know of MacGyver from references to MacGyver in other shows. And because it was the same actor from Stargate SG-1, which is a show that I love. Bit left, bit left. Okay, perfect. Let us try again. Okay. Didn't get a bad spawn. I don't think it's the best spawn, but it's fine. I hate it when they're already attacking. Because they could just rapid fire bug me. Again! Rockstar should just like, add in some additional dialogue. Where Pavel acknowledges that you're teleporting around the map. Are you using dark powers, Capitan? You seem to have teleported from my submarine to the other side of the map. We learned about witches like you in the old country. <laughs> what is Pavel's accent? Isn't it obvious? He's Australian. He's always like, G'day, Captain. How's it going? Crikey. Okay. A good feeling about this one, chat. It's a little bit close to the building, but it's fine. Uh, using this to clear that. Oh! Duh! So I was using. Simeon to clear the help text in the top left hand corner. I accidentally pressed A twice. Now that... That hurts. That physically, physically hurts. Uh, don't worry chat, that was gonna be a bad run anyway. That was, uh, <laughs> was... I was definitely gonna be tequila and stuff, man. I'm just, you know... <laughs> Anything you need, boss. I need you to let me travel back in time before I made that mistake. Give me your time travel powers. Bye. Bye to you too. I promised I would do better today. I did really badly yesterday, and so anything I do today is going to be better. <laughs> Alright, it's pretty good. It's crazy how I was completely incapable of doing that before, and now I can get it so quickly. It might be in part because I now have 100 out of 100 flying, though. Maybe. Okay. Do this warp thing. Did I forget anything, chat? I've called Simeon. Need to become an MC. Rip 25 grand. Okay, got a decent spawn. You think my time is more related to my confidence now? Have you seen how bad I am at flying the oppressor? I think that's also a significant bad part. Oh, crap. Oh, no, I'm not running a fight, you stupid fucking game! Okay, we're starting again. Like, a billion years could pass, chat, and I still won't be used to how fucking dumb the goddamn snack mechanic is in this fucking game. You're standing still, so you want a 10 second fucking animation to heal yourself 5 HP? Of course! Just remove the animations, Rockstar! Holy shit! I know! The weapon wheel! You can now use it, but just remove the animations! I mean, that was unfortunate that that happened. Damn. Yep. Hello! Goodbye! What are you doing? What are any of us doing? Why are any of us here? Just to suffer. And we have arrived. Please, let my sparrow be there. And not in the building. I hear, heard it. There it is. It's between the two buildings, man. Got kind of lucky. Okay, watch for this guard. Where's my simian job? And it was at the bottom, too. It's fine. No, it's not. I can't warp myself out. I got an easy one too. I'm pretty sure I can't call him, but we'll see. Hello, friend. I cannot pick up the phone. Yeah, I'm just fucked. So what if I fail to take me off the islands? New session would have required me to set up literally every th single thing again. 
which I'm obviously not gonna do. You are smuggler. Smuggler is disposable if caught in wrong place too many times. If I'm caught too many times, I'll be thrown off the island. I guess that's what I want. How many times do I have to get caught? Five times? Go back to the plane and press E. Still does not work. I'm assuming it's because I've already done the box, even though I haven't looked at the camera. If I look at the camera and use the plane, it'll count as intel being done and I'll lose 25 grand. This better only be five times, chat. Battle charge! No! What are you doing here? I'm trying to hurt you. I failed. Oh yeah, don't you normally talk to the guy in the chair? This guy over here? To leave? Nah, I guess not. That's earlier in the game. When you do care for the first time. Throw me off the islands! I should go on that TV show, Survivors, because I'll make it to the final because everyone just doesn't want to get me off the island. You reckon it's one more? Let's see if you're right, chat. You have been wrong 9,947 times thus far in my streaming career. Let's see if you can finally get that W. Pain! Well, rip all my prep. Have to do it all over again. <laughs> One more? That was definitely five! There was a dude in chat who was like, Hey man, I could do it like 15 times. I'm not gonna- No. We can just enjoy doing all the preps again. Great! So much, so much fun. <laughs> At least I don't have to go to the hangar again. I'm still running at the speed of sound. Hello. Why is so much of this game suffering, Pavel? Answer me! <laughs> okay. No more complaining, chat. I am being punished for how much I have complained. Just take it easy. Keep calm. Everything will be fine. Like right now, why am I not setting up the Simeon call? Just do it right now. So I can't forget. No problem. Coming right up. I'm already a motorcycle present. That's all good. First boat is not good placement? True. Should be up more. I don't have an up and atom atomizer. Up and atomizer is like 500 grand or some shit. That's fine. Okay, and now the sparrow. Okay, nothing could possibly go wrong this time, chat. Nothing. We failed in every conceivable way. And yes, I mean we. This is a team effort in the failures. Only I win though. If we succeed, only I succeed. Hello there. Hello. Fancy seeing you here, Pavel. Let's go. There we go. I made sure to make sure I was in the plane before I started spamming snacks. You're ruining my fucking takeoff with your bodies. <laughs> the door is stuck. Door stuck. Door stuck. Okay. Cool. Is that good? Why? I'm pressing F and it's trying to get me into this car all the way over here. Why, Rockstar? The helicopter's perfectly fine. It even has its tail. Well, gotta put another sparrow out in the fucking ocean. I'm getting mighty fed up with this bullshit chat. Yeah, as I said, it's impossible for me to fail. Rockstar failed me. I did nothing wrong, nor can I ever do anything wrong. At this point, I'm not sure if Masso will get a single run done today. If there's one trait that I have that is a good one, it is my stubborn refusal to give up. I will do this for the next 10,000 years, if I need to, to get this done. I will, with my feet, invent a way to make myself a morsel and not need food or sleep or any other thing that I normally require to function. Specifically to dedicate all of my existence to completing a single one of this. Have no doubt. Okay. Uh, that looked like it was moving forward a little bit as I was teleporting away. Okay. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Teleporty thing. Let us have another go at this. Uh, that's a good spawn. What? The thing I was saying about good spawn. I lied. Moving away! Thank you. Let's try again. 
Decent spawn. How many times have I flown this plane today, chat? Whatever number it is, it's too many. I'm so tired now after three hours that it's going to be a, a miracle if I do all the other strats correctly. Please, oh mighty rockstar gods, take pity on me and give me my Spara. If guards give a good look at you while you are in the restricted area, they will know something is not right. Something's not right, chat. I am very sad. This is brutal, chat. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. <laughs> I just barely caught that. After catching that, I deserve to win. But hell, I deserve to win three hours ago as well, and that didn't really help me, did it? Let's make like a tree and get out of here. This is the one that instantly killed me before. I think the spawn location here is not ideal. No! Yeah, it's not ideal. Okay. Phew. Stop shooting me! Rip snacks. I think this is the fastest one though. Please. Sparrow. Doesn't look like a very good spot, but we might be okay. Okay. At least I can get in it, but goddamn. We can actually play the video game! Oh my god! Being very careful with removing this help text. Okay, just please be on the bottom. I do not want to do this diving thing. Uh, I can't see the guard, so he might be good. No, there is a guard. Shit. Well, too late. He's so hard to see when the yellow dot's there. Well, huge time loss. I needed to expand that. True, that would have been a smart move, yeah. Sweet. What is the secret with the ladder? Tell me, what is the secret? Why is it my hitbox can't get around that spot? Right side only? Oh no, it works left. It just doesn't always work left. And you sit there for a few seconds as your character's like, I am too fat to fit through this gap in the side here. And you contemplate like, why would anyone design the game that way? Then you remember you're playing the game from Rockstar Games. You're like, oh yeah, never mind. Attention to detail is not their strong suit. I'm pressing the button to open the M menu and it's not working. Every other button is working. I'm holding this button, pressing M. Can I bring up my phone? I can. It's specifically M menu. It works now, I just... <laughs> Send help says it's because of independent camera mode, it glitches it. There is no game in existence that can cause so much suffering when you play it. It's like watching people be tortured with like the most gruesome specific techniques and you're like, this is the most horrifying thing ever, but really impressive that you spent this much time learning such amazing torture techniques. You're terrible, you're evil, but well done. So we'll get into this helicopter and test the M menu before I leave. It is still bugs. Okay, so I guess I'll turn off independent camera modes. It's fixed it. It does mean I won't have the correct camera when I get to the long fin, but I doubt I'll get to that point. You thought I hated G2 Online? What gave that away? This game's great. So, as I say, there's no way I've got sufficient energy to do everything right. So I'm just going to try my best to do everything at least somewhat right. That's the plan right now. Okay, good spawn, please. Decent spawn. I'm waiting for the rapid fire bug here, like I'm just gonna start crying. Don't do it, guys. Okay, we've dodged the first set of glitches, guys. We have a chance. Maybe the game will take pity on me and give me another panther. I mean, the statue, not the one in the cage. Okay, good RNG, please. Put the wires at the bottom of the tower. Okay, I don't see the guard. Ah, oh, it's over there. I was hoping to warp through the side, which is the thing you can do if it's in the other bottom spot. Oh no, math. Uh, these are ones, right? So it has to be this and then the... Yeah. Okay. Not bad. Let us do some window shopping, yes? I do want a good window. Please don't be tequila. What was it, chat? It was gems, so like the second worst one. This is not tequila. Um, vehicles, phantom wedge, 
Had a decent start, chat. Huzzah. I hope my phantom wedge spawns near me. I hope my phantom wedge spawns near me. There it is. It's pretty close. Kill me. Kill me. Thank you. Uh, I got it. Okay. I remember to bring up the map early. Okay. Need to get the oppressor. M. Enter. Got it. Cool. Um... Plasma cutter. Okay, take a picture. Call Pegasus. Easy. Picture. Gave it to him. Ah, damn it. Press the wrong button. So this is a teleport, but I have to wait for him to show me. Uh, not sure which one I meant to teleport to here, but... Okay, use keyboard and mouse for oppressor. Um, where is he? Wait. It's not the way I want to go. I'm gonna die. Let me out. Uh, I'm so happy it's so hard to fall off this thing. I would have been fucks. Get in the middle. Okay. Eat. Um, I need a warp here. Fingerprint cloner. Warp. I press the right one. I hope I press the right one. I'm so nervous, chat. One wrong button and I'm fucked. You know? Fine. I found it. Ah. Okay, that's actually not bad. I still don't know if first person or third person is faster in here. I think first person seems faster. Close one, that's good. I'm holding space, so I'm going down a little bit faster. Okay. <laughs> so nervous about going in the water there. Now the cutting torch, I'm easily the worst at. What? Turn, turn, turn. I, the door. Thank you. What? I lost the oppressor. What happened? <sighs> well, run's dead. And it's like five minutes before you can call it back anyway, so yeah, the run's dead. That sucks. Yeah, it was a good run too. I mean, I did get the furthest away construction site again, which I seem to get like every fucking time, but... I guess I'll just get the money now. Let's... let's not. Okay. Uh, could be... Check over here. Nope. Nope. Yeah, this one wasn't gonna be good anyway. Which one haven't I checked? So I assumed it's bugged again, so it's not giving me the green- Ah, oh, here we go. I swear to the fucking god I went to this one. I still need the oppressor for this spot. Why- Why does it do that? What is this accept screen? Oh, is it up here? Oh, it is this one. I wish I could just identify which building it was based on the yellow dot, but this is a fucking Rockstar game, so that's impossible. Why would Rockstar ever design something that'd be even mildly helpful to the player base? A lot of this in first person is really fucking slow. There we go. That looks half decent, maybe a little bit to the right. Yeah, that was good. Damn bad RNG. Good. I wonder if I could have dived off into getting the key. Nice, got the gate key immediately. I was not looking forward to remembering the route to get the other dudes. Getting good at that. There's definitely a lot of parts here that I should be in third person for. Like, you see how long it took to spin me around with first person? In some places, animations are fast in first person, but are sometimes in third person as well. If it wasn't for losing the oppressor, well, this run would have been pretty good. Sure, the construction yard was super far away, and I didn't find the thing for ages. So, like, I lost three and a half minutes on one split, and every other split was fine, basically. So if I hadn't have lost my oppressor, I probably would have got sub 25. What a massively painful four hours and 20 minutes. Exactly right. No. Five minutes. This was hell. I hope it can be made into a good video, though.
for the people who enjoy suffering. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out. I wish you all the best. Boop.